Hey guys, what is up? It is Remix here, and today I wanted to give you a review on the Nokia Lumia 920. I know this video is going up kind of late. This phone came out about two and a half years ago, but I still wanted to give you guys what I think about it. Um, this is the red version. As you can see, the little dot right there. And this is what it looks like when you get it from at and It comes in like a box like this. Um, I have it set up for straight talk, but today I'm showing you how to use it and how to set it up. Now when you open it, you're going to want to flip it over like this so you see the at and sign and you'll see your gorgeous phone right there. Uh, we'll get back to the phone here in a second. Uh, there comes with this little tab right here to lift it up and out. Right here is your uh, SIM card door key and that is just to eject your SIM card which is on the top of the phone right here it just pops out like that you pull it out and there's your SIM card and then you just slide it right back in and your SIM cards in um, I will have to restart my phone um, I've been using this phone for about three weeks now two three weeks loving it ever since never gonna deny you that I've ever used that uh, when you open it, you get the quick start. It just tells you little things on how to use your phone, like windows, keys, lock screen, unlock screen, swipe, and all that stuff. And then here's your little bit more complex guide. It's your product of safety. And then this thing, I've not gotten that thing to work. I don't get how to do that. Um, then you got your charger from Nokia. And it's pretty cool. Um, here's the cord. It's a three foot, I believe. It's either three or five. Three. And to the phone. Now, when you turn this phone on, it'll come up with this screen. And then it'll come up with your carrier screen. The only branding it's got is the Nokia right there, AT&T. On the back it's got the branding for the lens, which is the Carl's S lens for the camera. Uh, this is what it'll look like when you activate a live screen. You're just going to unlock it. And here's your home screen. Um, I have it set up to show more apps, which you can do by going like this opening your settings or you can go to it like this going to start and theme and going down to here and setting it to use more tiles I'm gonna do this guys for you um, I have the brightness set down because it doesn't have the best battery but it's better than the last phone that I had um, in storage sense it has about 30 gigabytes of data on it um, as you guys can see I've used up 13.94 and have 15.8 left um, it is 4G um, it's got no lag Um, you can set it to have a high, whoops, a high touch screen, so you can use it through gloves and stuff. Um, a lot of the apps are in beta, like here, 
you go to in, let's go to Instagram. Uh, you can just do this to search. You can tap the letter, and you go to I. Whoops. And then you can see that it says Instagram beta right there. Um, it's also got Facebook beta. It doesn't say it. What else does it got beta? It's got a lot of stuff beta. But, anyway, um, it's pretty nice. Um, this phone with contract will run you about 100 without contract, it's about 600. But I find it worth it because of the main part of the camera. It's got an 8.7 megapixel camera. Um, you can go like this and see how there's like no movement and I'm moving my hand way more than most people would so um, how you tell if it's working or not is you look at the top and you'll see a little light um, you might not be able to see it but there's a little light on the top right there right above the speaker and it's a green now put all this stuff back in the box close it up um on your side, you can just see all the stuff. This one costed me 820. Um, as you guys can see, it is the 920. It's on both sides. Uh, there's nothing on the other side. Um, that, uh, it can come in black, white, blue, red, and yellow. Um, my favorite color is red, so I chose red. And that is pretty much it. That's all I have for you guys today. And, um, later on I will be uploading a video on how to fix your PS3 controller when it is broken. Um, it's just pretty much how to fix any button on it if it doesn't work. And see you guys then.